Okay, ladies, what are we shooting today? This is a Ruger Blackhawk convertible. 45 long Colt, 45 ACP. And this is the flat top frame. As you can see, it's, uh, it's flat. This is a uh, limited run for one of the distributors. Five and a half inch barrel. And uh, I'm not sure which distributor these were made for. If it was Taylor or one of the other ones. Bought the gun used and uh, got a pretty good deal on it. This this thing is it's a joy to shoot. I'm going to pull the uh, right hand grip off and show you the only modification I've made to the gun. Okay, I took the right hand grip panel off to show you the only mods to this gun that I've made. This is the trigger spring. That's the right hand side. And you can see the left hand side up in there is still connected or still looped over this little pin. You just take one of these one side or the other off of the off of the pin that it rests on and it reduces the trigger pull. The main spring in this gun has been uh, also replaced with the aftermarket. So that's the only mods I've made to this gun. I'm going to be shooting some 250 grain lead vodka or lead uh, 45 long colt and some reloaded 200 grain 45 ACP. Love the watt cutters. So let's see how she does on some targets. Okay, I'm filming this adventure uh, myself and handling everything with a phone camera in one hand and all the action in the other. So I'm gonna to try to show you how simple it is to change the cylinder out in this gun and I'm gonna do it one-handed. Okay, press this, pull the pin out Yep, there we go. Open the loading gate, and the cylinder falls out. Okay, 45 long Colt cylinder. Drop it in the window, and finagle it a little bit, line it up. Uh, I'm gonna close the loading gate just to kind of hold it in there, and put the pin back in. So, if you're wondering, should I get one of these or should I not uh, get one? This thing is so much fun to shoot. That's what it's all about. Look at that, one-handed, change the cylinder out. So see how easy it is? Okay, we're gonna open the loading gate and I'm going to load the long Colt one-handed. There we go. Last one. Okay, first up, six rounds of 45 long Colt. 15 yards. Let's do a little accuracy test offhand. Okay, I can see my group, not the best, not the worst I've done. Let's uh, empty her out, then we'll swap the cylinders. Out with a long coat. ACP cylinder in. It just takes a few seconds, really. All right, wide cutters going in. I probably reloaded these. Thinking back, maybe it's been probably 14 years ago, and no problem at all. Okay. Don't need a. Uh, any additional accessories to shoot a 45 ACP in this gun? Cylinders made for it, and 
Here we go. 15 yards, 45 ACP. Right. All six, plus one extra that I tried to snap that wasn't there. Let's go down and check out the target. Okay, not a bad group of 45 long colts. I would call that about three inches at 15 yards. And 45 ACP. Uh, I don't know what I did there. Looks like I got one over here to the right of the target, one dead on, and then four almost in the same hole. So I don't know if I had the sights figured out there after a couple rounds. And I've only shot this gun once prior to today. So uh, if I'm going to be shooting anything seriously with, a, with the wad cutters, I'm going to need to practice on the sights. Get the sight picture down. But the long colt looks really good. Definitely kill a bar with that. Okay, six more rounds of 45 long colt, 250 grain lead at 15 yards. Okay, they're all over the target. I can see it from here. Let's go down and check her out. Yes, yeah, pretty bad pattern, but could be getting fatigued. Wind's blowing. I don't know, had a gnat in my eye. There you go. Pretty bad. But uh, it's me, it's late in the day, and nowhere near as good as the last six I shot that were ACP. And I don't think it's the ammo, I don't think it's the gun, it's just me. But I'm gonna try putting it on some steel now just for fun. Let's try wringing out the plates. Okay, I've only got five rounds of 45 ACP left, so let's see if we can uh, put it on some steel plates. Blackhawk in your collection, you need to get one. These uh, convertibles allow you to shoot two different calibers, so you uh, you just can't beat them. And boy, are they fun to shoot. Get one.